That's why Yingwei Cheng development, think about all the things you do in the school, is considered development. A lot of things in the school develop is not, doesn't help you to apply an uh, uh, application. They only for develop you have the skill to apply. It's not a apply what you do in the school. I'll give you an example. Like turning. Turning like this. You develop just know how to turn it. You understand why you want to do turning because I want to swing my body and control my center of gravity. Keep it straight. Uh, turning. But in fighting, I don't turn punch people like that. I don't go in from my stepping punch. But that development already have the step I have, I already have the turning within the stand. Okay, that is a skill you develop. You understand what you develop and make it work for yourself. But do not based on what you do in the development. Everything in there, in the one group. In there. In the state, I move you out. The way I step is open your gate. Okay, that's the moment. But how I step out without lack it moving you, because I control my center gravity, I control you. I, I feel your con uh, center gravity. That means I'm not making you lose it. Because I make you lose it, I don't control anymore. Anytime I want to control you, I want you to stay there. Let me play with you. That's the concept of Wing Chun. Just like a king, okay, the walking king. I got to know how to hold it right. I don't hold the king so heavy, so tight, just naturally, hold enough. I hold the king natural tension. Then when I put the king down on the floor, now I, I feel the king can support me. Then I start to walk. It's natural force. Okay, same thing. My opponent in sticky hand, in fighting, he is my king. My walking king. If I can control the walking king, I can control everything. Understand what I mean? That's why the 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 drill that you do in sticky hand is learn how to control people's center gravity. That's your king, the walking king. Okay. But in order to learn how to control him, you gotta know how to feel your own controlling too. I got to know how to stand straight before I can control the stick, touch the stick down, now you walk. But if I cannot even stand straight and losing, I cannot even control the stick. See, that's a way to learn about yourself, then you can apply yourself to the other. That's the concept. Now, when I when you stick your hand, the, the one we do in the class, okay, when I step in that moment, see, I, my body control my two hands, that's an uh, equal side triangle. When I step like that, automatically my, my, my body will turn. Okay, I don't step like this. I step like boom, already turn. Okay, that way I open you and then get you with the hand. That means I wire myself already. From here, look at my body. I turn this way, uh, see my body wire up. Then my shoulder will wire up and hit you push back out. It hit you boom, I push up. It hit your palm. Now when I hit your palm, what happened? This side, I will come back. I set, set, set up the second one now. Second one, I punch out. And then the third one, I set up another punch out. That means my body already the call, call, uh, the, 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 what do you call it? Oh, yeah. Have the, the, the function, help you the second motion already. They go wind up your motion for second one. They, those are development. Plus, we move forward. I move forward and you cannot feel me move forward. You will stay there, got hit and left. <laughs> That's the way you feel. Be, think about that. If I go and push people forward, I push him back and hit him, I lose my power. Because I won't hear the subject moving back to here. I want them, at least the subject stay there, I hit from 100%. If he coming to me, fine, the more. But the minimum, the zero point, I'll make him stay first. Then I hit him, I get 100%. If he come in, when I, I pull him into me that moment, can be 200% right there. I have 100%, he have 100%, come boom, 200%. Okay. But if he going back like this, he has 100%, by the time he reach him, 50% only. Because he's going away from your punch. He getting away from your force. That's why in sticky hand, which first thing we develop how to stand still. 
Don't move uh, any time. Don't try to move forward backward. I want to hit you. I have solar ground. <coughs> I hit you because I have solar ground. But if I'm moving in to hit you, I lose my solar ground. The punch won't get 100%. This is why when I hit you, I go in step. Now I play my foot. <coughs> I hit you. I'm not moving my stand anymore. By the time I hit, boom, I, I'm not moving my leg. Okay. That's the way you develop. How do you coordinate your three structure work together? Understand that? Those are things you have to pay attention to develop your sticky hand. Three structure work together. They work together in one unit. That one unit is everything within. The 13 principle is one, one is 13 principle. 